Welcome everyone to my new video presentation for LBank Cryptocurrency Futures Trading Exchange, Spot Trading as well, no KYC needed, and it's friendly with the VPN as well, so you can have a good time with that one. I'd like to share with you a tutorial video how to surf around the platform and how to take advantage of its great benefits. Before we get started, make sure to utilize the link in the description area or in the comments area to sign up. You're going to be eligible to bonuses in USDT for every single volume you produce and for every single move you're doing on the platform. There is a whole lot of the things, especially bonuses up to $5,000. Now, LBank has this specific features of spot trading and futures trading. It also has the copy trading as well. And for those of you that would like to buy cryptocurrency with fiat currency with their platform, you actually need to do your KYC for that. So it's not really suggested, but they're pretty much great for futures trading or spot trading at the end of the day, which is why we're making this video. I'm already logged into my platform. You know, you just want to go ahead into your spot and your wallet right here, spot, get your deposit into the spot, basically. Simple, just like all the other exchanges where you pretty much have the tokens. You can search whatever token you would like to deposit. For example, USDT, we go to deposit tab and we you know, have the ability to select the networks, deposit on the cheapest network available on the fastest one and copy the address from here send the cryptocurrency to that one it's simple right the same thing goes in with the withdrawal as well this is one of the features once you got resources you have to you know move your resources into the futures right so you have to transfer the margin this is once you go to your futures wallet you just transfer your margin from spot into the futures and you can utilize that basically into your future trading account to perform trading right there for example right now there is a margin balance in the futures of 15 bucks and 86 cents just to share with you a quick tutorial on that now once we got our resources in the futures we go to the futures on the top bar right there and we got the ability to start executing trades. How does it work? Well, from the top left corner, you have the ability to select your assets, which helps you to navigate between. For example, if we stay in the BTC, that's fine. We're always going BTC perpetual contracts. We have the ability to search, you know, whatever kind of crypto, for example, Avalanche, right? Or any other crypto out there i'm not going to trade that i'm fine with a btc then we got a funding and a countdown as well for anyone that is going on the leverage must know about the funding rates uh the timer including as well the pricing the volume you know the order books the charting as well and then of course on the top corner and on the top side it's actually where the whole place where the trading is happening uh, with the cross leverage or isolated, these are two different things that you would like to control, including hedging turn on, or it's just one way. Hedging means that you can simultaneously have longs and shorts out of the same assets. For example, BTC against USDT, I can open up a long position right here. And in 10 minutes, I'm going to also open up a short position. So I'm going to have both of my positions active if I have it on hedge. If I have it just one way, then I cannot open up a position in the opposite direction if I already have one running in the opposite direction, right? So that one makes sense, right? Hedging is you can have both one way, it's just one way. Then next to it, you got the leverage for the long, which is with a green color up to 200x, which is quite a lot. It's quite crazy. Leverage for short as well. And that's pretty much it, of course. You have the ability to use their calculator as well and calculate based on your entry price, the amount of BTC or the amount in the USDT exit price with the leverage you go, your performance. For example, we got an entry of 50 grand amount, 150,000, the exit at 60 grand, right? So we're going to use a 5x leverage. The initial margin, the PL, and the profit and loss as well, it's all pretty much shared over there. This, you know, you can calculate your PL, target prices, liquidation price as well, and everything is possible with that way. 
Then you got your open order closing the order, so you can go both ways with a limited market orders, right? Limit orders allow you to set the price. Market orders will get you the best price existing in the order book. And simply then just, you know, move around with a percentage you would like to use out of your margin, which is shown right there on the bottom side, where you can actually uh, cost the value, convert the contract units into cost value as DT. So you, you clearly see basically uh, how much are you gonna use nominal value that's also fine as well so we got basically available 15.86 cents and we clearly see how much margin are we going to use for a 200x leverage by doing so if we you know go on a 40x you have to be careful because changing one leverage is just one leverage. It doesn't change you automatically for the short one. And every single asset is having their own leverage representation. So you have to, if you go right now on the Ethereum page and you want to trade that one, you know, you're going to be pretty much uh, needing to change the leverage over there as well, right? So I'm going to put that one in 100X leverage. I'm just going to open up a trade on 100X leverage. No problem with that. I like to short the market here, right? It looks great. I'm going to go with a maximum size. We're shorting the market over there. And we're going to have the ability to see the order right there going live with the unrealized profit being shown with a liquidation price as well, which is a 57,461, right? Or near to us, 57,344 is right now. So we can easily get liquidated on that. Got to speak quite quickly what's happening here, folks. Uh, take profit as well. You have the ability to set that up. Put a trigger price. It tells you automatically how much money you're going to have. You also have the ability to put, you know, a, a, a stop loss too. For example, if I don't want to get liquidated right here, which is the 57,461, I'm going to put a 57,440. Stop loss. I'm going to lose 4.30 cents. And if I set a take profit here of 57, 0, 10, I'm going to make 16 bucks on that trade. Obviously, with my entire position and then confirm. Right. So if the market uh, goes to those prices, it's going to pretty much automatically close. It's in the open orders. You will be able to see it over there take profit and the stop loss trigger prices, right? 57.10, 57.440. And I'm pretty much secure. I can pretty much safely walk away from the screen. You can also do a market close, which means to close your trade, you know, instantaneously at this price straight away. And the price that is the best on the order book is going to be for you. You can also do pretty much limit order closes by, you know, doing the price, putting up the price here, you know, 57, 199, going with 100%, 50%, 25% of the quantity, just you know, and they hit the close. So you're going to have a limit order set at that specific value. And you're going to close your trade at that value in a limit order, which will cost you less in terms of fees than a market order executed with a take profit or stop loss. Right. So limit orders will always cost you less on an exchange in the futures than a market order. Uh, $3 profit on that one. Obviously, we're just joking here, folks, on the you know, trade. I did a 200x leverage. Not the, Definitely not suggesting you to do that one. Uh, but at the end of the day, I'm just here to share with you a tutorial presentation and the way how it works on the platform, right? So that's pretty much all. You also have the other informations around here. You have the ability to reverse your position. If you instantly would like to jump out of this trade into the other direction under the same conditions, you got your reverse possibility here. Uh, this is the notional value of our trade. Uh, this is actually a 200x short. It's not 100x because we put 100x on the long and I shorted the short remain on a 200x. That's pretty much wild, guys, which is why the liquidation is so close to us. But obviously, this is just a tutorial. You don't do 100x or 200x. You're very careful with 2, 3, 4, 5x leverages, which are you know, proper and conservative numbers, but that's a different topic, right? So that's pretty much all where we are with this one. This is how you can trade in the futures market with all the features needed, with all the abilities and all the conditions out here. You just have a great platform to perform, guys. 
have a good time. At the end of the day, it's just about being able to trade in the futures market, no KYC needed and friendly with a VPN. I definitely enjoy that. Enjoy, like the video. If you have any other questions about, let me know. Share your thoughts in the comments area. Check out all the links with the bonuses and discounts and all the promotional campaigns they have in the description area or comments area. You get access to that. Enjoy, guys. Have a good time.